Meta Software Engineer just put out one of the best system design roadmaps that I've seen this year and I want to go over it. In this video, I want to talk about like each of the problems that he talks about and kind of what this means for your preparation. Okay, yeah, so I have them here on my phone. I'm going to put them on the side here and we're just going to go look at this. So um, I'm Evan, I'm a staff engineer at Meta. Uh, he works out Hello Interview and um, I think this is, again, I think this is probably one of the best things, right? So just number one is that like, when I was doing system design, I thought you were just supposed to like do theory, 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 theory. So I was like, oh, I'm gonna read designing data intensive applications. I'm gonna like read this. I'm gonna like understand like fundamentally like how do caches work? And I, I made a video about it that got like 100,000 views, you know, just breaking down that book. But when I would, do, when I would actually do my interviews, like my, my um, designs and like everything was just like slower. And a lot of it was because it's really hard to code design Facebook. It's really hard to fake design Facebook in 30 minutes in an interview. And the only way that you actually get to be able to do that in 30 minutes is unless you like rehearsed the actual problems. And so this is what he's saying in here, which is that like you need to essentially just rehearse the problems, know all of them and like memorize like the canned kind of responses. And I think that's actually the true, true, true thing about like what a system design interview is. Um, I think I leaned too much into studying and the theory and like the possible questions they could ask you. But like, if you just study specific problems, if you just practice specific problems and you just iterate, iterate, iterate on those, I think you're going to be set up way, 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 way better. Um, and so I wish I did more, like, this is why if you look at my videos, I say, I wish I did more mock interviews because, because if I had done more mocks, I would have gotten more practice in, I would have been like more fluid. I would have been able to do it faster. And I would have like, you know, known everything, but like for, a lot of the system design problems, um, I didn't do that. And so I just like did worse. Um, and that is like, yeah. So I'm changing like my, my kind of like approach when it comes to these system design things, which is that like, I think you just do reps on problems and I think it sucks at the start. I think you don't know what's happening at the start, but then you just go back, look at the solution and try to improve. And so that's what he's saying, like in this kind of like article rate. Right? which is, okay, can you design lead code? Can you design WhatsApp? Can you design newsfeed? Can you design Ticketmaster? Honestly, um, I have a video maybe a couple of months ago where I was saying the exact thing where I kind of had this realization where like there's only like 10 system design problems. And if you just memorize the solutions to those, you're going to do fine. And like, this isn't about you reading and like memorizing. It's like you actually have to do the practice because that's like half of the interview is like, you need to be fast on these because you only get 30 minutes to design WhatsApp. And so you need to be able to just draw out whatever it is from memory um, very, very quickly. And, and um, the fact that like, that's like a big edge, I think in interviews is that you know what you're going to be asked. Like, you know, you're only going to be asked some 10 questions because it's only 30 minutes. They can only ask you so much stuff and then you just drill and memorize them. So again, I think this is one of the best system design uh, roadmaps that I've seen. And I'm definitely going to be like just preaching this and pushing it and pushing it and pushing it because I think it 100% works. Um, there was a system design, ro there was a system design roadmap that I used to use, which was from a Apple senior engineer. And um, his thing was like just theory, theory. A little bit and it was like kind of confusing it was like kind of tossing out all these other things but honestly i think that uh the hello interview way like the evan you know uh, his way is just way better so i uh, wanted to make a video to kind of go over that and i'll see you guys later